you can't have one without the other. David Blight has written this very succinct description of the difference between the two. And um, for history, he really argues that it's a very reasoned reconstruction of the past using the archive, using interpretation, and also um, then the scholar kind of weaving a narrative around what that is. Memory for me is really interesting because I see memory as housed in individual minds. It's if we think about uh, kind of the physiology of what memory does. And so those two things are quite different. If it's individual memory, it can be transitory about what we think the past is. Whereas history is really, for me, is about interpretation. It's about digging deep in the archives, marshalling those resources, and telling a story about it, about the past.